Let's go to KFC for lunch, guys. No way. Let's go to McDonald's. Ludo's right. McDonald's is way better than KFC. No, it's not. McDonald's is nasty. Then I challenge you to a McDonald's versus KFC build challenge. Come on, Axie. Let's start building our amazing McDonald's. Good luck, Wudo. Your McDonald's is gonna be worse. No, it's gonna be way better than your stinky KFC. Axie, if we wanna build the best McDonald's, then we need the best blocks for it. Luckily, the colors of McDonald's is very easy. All we need to do is grab some red and yellow blocks, and now we pretty much have everything that we need to build the exterior. So, I'm gonna start building the front entrance of our McDonald's. Whoa! What kind of McDonald's are we gonna make? This isn't just gonna be any normal McDonald's, Axie. It's going to be a mega McDonald's. That's how we're gonna steal the competition from Mongo and make sure that all of our customers come to our McDonald's instead of his stinky KFC. That's right, but I don't think the customers need any persuading. Who even likes KFC? KFC does have some pretty good chicken. Chicken Axie, but why would you want chicken when you can have chicken McNuggets? They're like 10 times better, you know. That's right, Woodle. Even though I'm not really sure if there's actually chicken in the McDonald's one. Oh, there definitely is, Axie, because we're gonna build the kitchen too, and all the ingredients that we need for our favorite McDonald's meals. Check it out. There's so much McDonald's food I have, from hamburgers to the chicken nuggets nuggets to even soda. Doesn't this look sick, Axie? It doesn't look sick, Wudo. It looks delicious. Exactly. So come on. We're almost done building the actual outside of our McDonald's. Now that we have the floor set up, we can start building the walls. And for the walls, I want to make it look really, really fancy because this is a mega McDonald's. Let me grab some dark concrete and some glass and also also some oak wood so that we can make our McDonald's stand out from Mongo's KFC. Remember, Axie, the KFC is also going to be made out of red blocks. It's almost like they're copying our logo, but they're not because it is completely different. So the only other way to make it different is by doing all these different build styles. Well, I thought you were making a W. Look, it kind of looks like your name. Aw, that looks kind of funny, Axie, but it's not a W. It's just a really cool design look that I'm going for. Check this out. I'm putting down windows over here, too. There's going to be a nice big window over here to let in plenty of natural sunlight for our customers to enjoy. Whoa, I can't wait to be a customer and eat here every day. Well, Axie, we can't be customers, silly. We need to help with the preparation of the food. Seriously? But I want to sit down and do nothing. Well, you'll get to sit down and do nothing once we hire some employees to help us cook the food. But for now, you're going to be the one flipping burgers in the kitchen, Axie. Sorry. I don't want to flip burgers. I'll make milkshakes, but that's it. Ooh, milkshakes sound really good too, Axie. And I'm going to make sure that our ice cream machine works. Did you know that KFC doesn't even have ice cream? What losers. Seriously? What fast food place doesn't have ice cream? I know, right? Hey, I heard that. I'm going to make sure that my KFC is a special case and has milkshakes. Hold on a second, Mongo. You're changing the menu. That's not fair. You're only allowed to sell what KFC actually has, okay? Well, who said they're not just going to actually add the milkshakes today, Wudo? I talked to the KFC owner, and that's what he told me. Wait, what? You know the KFC owner? That's so cool. I don't know the McDonald's owner. He's probably way too rich to even want to talk to me. No, Wudo. We're going to get rich enough to talk to him. And then he's going to hire us to be his managers. 
You really think so, Axie? That would be my dream come true. Yeah, Wudo, the owner of the KFC is called Jim Bob. His name is Jim Bob Mongo? Are you sure you're actually talking to the real owner of KFC? It sounds like you're talking to a fake one. No, Wudo, trust me. I definitely know that he's the real one. Okay, sure, Mongo. If he really is the real one, then he would be super excited by how amazing the outside of our McDonald's is looking. Let's take a look at Mongo's and Oh, wow. Mongo's actually doesn't look too bad either come on axie that means we need to work a bit harder to make sure that our mcdonald's stands out way more yeah also in a little bit maybe we can go mess with mongo's build a bit wait axie don't say that too loudly i was already planning to do that but we can't do it right now mongo doesn't have enough to destroy on his build yet but we'll get to it <laughs> that sounds super mean what I I want to do right now, Axie, is put the official McDonald's logo. Are you ready to see it? Do it. All right. Here it goes in three, two, one, and check out the massive logo. Now, everyone can see that we have an amazing McDonald's on our side, and then all of Mongo's customers from KFC will want to come to us instead of him. Oh, Woodo, guess what? What is it now, Mongo? I already have my logo in the front. Look. That's your logo? They're just banners. Look at our logo. It's the real deal. Yeah, well, my KFC is automatically better because my outside looks cooler. Your outside looks cooler, Mongo. Are you sure you're wearing your glasses? Because that's not true at all. Our McDonald's is looking 10 billion times better. I mean, look at it from the outside. It looks like the real deal, Axie. But come on. Now that we basically have the outside finished, what we can do is grab our trusty little world at it once and fill in the rest of this place with red concrete blocks. We can? And then can we start making the fries and the smoothies? Oh, yeah, Axie. The first thing we're going to do is work on the kitchen because I am so hungry. And the only thing that can quench my hunger are some delicious McFries. So why don't we get started on that right now? We need to build the kitchen in the back because we don't want to disturb any of our guests who come from the entrance. So if we want to build a McDonald's kitchen, Axie, we need a couple of things. For example, a furnace to bake all of our goods and then we also need some fryers and some oil to make sure that we can deep fry all the stuff that we need and then I think the only other thing we have to get is some counter space to make sure that there's plenty of room to prepare all the delicious food. Are you ready to put it all together now Axie? Yeah and maybe we can make some new menu items if we're gonna be deep frying stuff Let's deep fry ice cream. Deep fried ice cream? That actually doesn't sound too bad, Axie. I might make you in charge of the menu. But for now, we better start by putting down the stoves and that counter space that I was talking about. Because we're going to be working with so much oil, Axie, we should also probably grab a kitchen hood, which is going to make sure that all of the oil splashes and other nasty stuff from the cooking process goes through these pipes and not around the restaurant so it doesn't bother our customers. Oh, that makes sense, Wudo. There's gonna be a lot of smoke and steam and stuff in this kitchen. Exactly, because we're gonna be producing a ton of food for all of our customers, unlike Mongo's measly KFC, which is probably only gonna have two people. And look, Axie, looking at my spy vision, he's already working on the inside. I can't wait to mess with the after he builds some stuff. 
I'm going to go in there and fart right in front of him. Okay, okay, but don't tell everyone just yet, Axie. It's going to be a surprise. For right now, we need to work on placing down our ingredients. And there are a ton of ingredients, Axie. Check it out. We have tomatoes and potatoes. You definitely need both if you want to have a successful McDonald's. Yeah, tomatoes for ketchup and burgers and potatoes for fries. You got that right, Axie. And luckily, I have crates filled with potatoes and crates filled with tomatoes. I think I'm also going to grab some other vegetables as well. For example, some lettuce, because we need to make sure that we actually have the toppings for our delicious McDonald's burgers. What toppings do you like on your burger, Woodle? Me personally, Axie, I like all the toppings that are on every Everything at McDonald's, they just make it so tasty. I agree, Woodle. My favorite topping is the raw fish. Raw fish? I don't remember that being a topping, Axie, but sure, you can enjoy some raw fish here at McDonald's. Just make sure you don't feed it to any real customers, okay? That could cause some problems. What? Why? I'm sure all customers like raw fish on their burgers. I don't know about that, Axie. But check this out. I just finished putting down all the ingredients necessary for us to make our food. And now that we have all these down, we can start the preparation area here on this counter. I'm going to put two layers of counters so that one can be responsible for one type of food and then another for the other. And I'm going to stretch it out all the way like this. Now what I can do is I can grab some item frames and we can start putting in all the ingredients together. If we want to make a McDonald's hamburger, then we're going to need to start with some raw beef patties and then cook them. Once they're cooked, we can put some cheese with it with a bunch of condiments and then we can make it a delicious cheeseburger. So I'm going to put all these items out. Here's the raw beef patty that's turned cooked in combination with some cheese and some bread as well because you can't have a burger without some delicious bread. And now that you have all of that, you can also grab some condiments like ketchup and there is plenty of it over here. And then voila, you have your delicious McDonald's cheeseburger. Wow, it looks so realistic. You want to take a bite, Axie? Go ahead and be my guest. I'm not going to take just a bite. I'm going to eat all of it. Yum, 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 yum. Yum, yum. Oh, man, that looks so good. I better prepare a lot more of those. Let me go over here by the fryers, and I'm going to put down some fries as well. I love French fries, so we better make sure that there's plenty of them for us to eat. And luckily, they're really easy to make. All we got to do is just take frozen potato sticks and then put them in the fryer to turn into McDonald's French fries. This McDonald's is looking really good, Hudo. When should we go mess with Mongo, though? I want to see what he's building. Oh, yeah, you're right, Axie. I almost forgot. We really do need to go mess with him. We can continue working on our kitchen after we're done destroying that KFC. So let me just get a spyglass real quick and let's spy on what Mongo's doing over there at the Colonel's Fried Chicken. There you go. I just need to put down my seats just like this. It looks like he's working more on the interior, Axie, and we need to destroy it right now. Look at his little kitchen. It looks pretty cool, but it's so much tinier than our amazing kitchen. And plus, we're not even done building it yet. But what are we going to do to destroy it? If we just blow it up, he'll know it's us. Well, we can do a favor for Mongo's customers. Let's change everything KFC related to McDonald's food without Mongo knowing. Oh, 
that's super evil. We need to go undercover for this, Axie. Quick, I'm gonna splash you with a fresh invisibility potion. Three, two, one. Operation Destroy KFC is now in effect. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Udo, I think I'm stepping on your foot. No, Axie, you are. Ouch. Anyways, come on. There's the Colonel's fried chicken. All I need to do is just delete it over here and instead put some delicious McDonald's fries and a delicious double cheeseburger. He's gonna have no idea, but his customers are gonna be so thankful that it's not fried chicken. I'm gonna add some signs up here, too. You are? You should totally do that. And you know what else we can do, Axie? What, Woodle? What can we do? We can put some ads for McDonald's on the walls as well, but be careful. Mongo's roaming around the inside now. I just finished the roof of this KFC and it's looking amazing. Let me just finish placing down the seats and I should be almost done. Yes, Axie, this is perfect. I'm gonna grab some graffiti real quick and let's go on this big wall so that I can put in my McDonald's advertisement. Check out this bad boy, Axie. It looks amazing. And here it goes in three, two, one. And look, it's a Happy Meal ad. You put a Happy Meal ad? in the KFC. That's so funny. I know. And it looks so, so tasty. Way better than whatever Mongo's trying to cook in here. Hmm. Wait a second. There's something different about my KFC. I just can't tell what it is. And <gasps> wait, what? Is that a McDonald's logo? I don't remember putting a McDonald's logo on my Kentucky Fried Chicken. You know what? I need to take this down. What? How dare Mongo disrespect McDonald's, Axie? Now that he's done that, he's declared war. Wait, those are my signs, Woodle. Oh, sorry, Axie. I didn't mean to do that. But what we can put instead is an amazing McDonald's menu to help all the customers order some actual food. <laughs> this is genius. Oh, I guess I'll put my sign somewhere else. What about a Grimace shake, Axie? We can't forget about how delicious those were. What's a Grimace shake? That doesn't sound good. It is delicious, Axie. And whoa, I made it gigantic. Am I vandalizing Mongo's KFC right now by doing this? Probably, but who cares? Look, I even put in a grimace. And then lastly, on this side, I'm just going to put one more McDonald's advertisement. And now everything is proper inside of this KFC. Or I guess you could call it a McKFC. <laughs> Wait a second. What's going on? Why are there so many McDonald's themed stuff inside of my KFC? Where did you come from, Grimace? Uh-oh, Mongo's getting really mad. I guess the only thing that's left to do, Axie, is to throw down a bunch of cheeseburgers and run! You know what? I need to get rid of this wall. Boom! Oh my gosh! Mongo just destroyed his own KFC to remove my advertisement? Dude, this is gonna get some really bad reviews for him. Does he hate McDonald's that much? Oh no, I didn't know it was gonna destroy my kfc don't worry axie our haters will be our biggest motivators let's grab some milk and remove our invisibility so that we can work on making our mcdonald's way better than whatever mongo fixes in his kfc we were working on the kitchen and i actually got an idea i have a bunch of these really cool advertisements so what we should be doing to show them off is build our checkout account Counter where we can start feeding our customers. Check out, Connor. You're going to be behind the counter, right? Because I'm just going to be a customer. Oh, don't worry, Axie. I will definitely be behind the counter taking orders for everyone. All I need is a fancy cash register that I'll put right over here to the side. And then we can actually put a couple of cash registers because of how many customers we're going to get. Udo, I have my apron and I'm ready. Yay! Axie is totally ready to cook. 
So what I need to do is just grab some of these pressure plates real quick for our food area. And then Axie, once everyone's done checking out, they can go to this dedicated area over here to pick up their food. Okay, Woodle, I'm tired of wearing this apron. You go behind the counter and I'm gonna order some food. Wait, but Axie, you can't order without knowing the menu. We can't forget about that, silly. So I'm gonna put another couple of slabs on top of this ordering area. And then I can grab my trusty graffiti and I can put the advertisement on a big wall up here so that you can see all the delicious food that McDonald's has to offer. But Wudo, I already have the menu memorized by heart. You do? That's pretty fancy, Axie. But it's not enough. We need to make sure that our customers know what's on the menu. They can't memorize it all the time, but this sign will make it incredibly easy for them. I'm gonna paste it a couple of times here just to make it very clear how much better our food is compared to KFC. Everything is zero dollars, Wudo. Well, yeah, let's just say we're running a very, very big promotion right now, Axie. We're not going broke or anything. Are you sure? Yes, Axie, I am 100% sure. Business will be booming once we start things off. But for right now, this is looking super duper cool. Now that this is all done, we can actually practice taking an order. Go ahead, Axie. You're next in line. Okay, can I? I have a triple, double, quadruple, uh, quintuple cheeseburger, please. You can get a bag of fries, Axie. Thank you. Have a nice day. That's not how customer service should be. Be Woodo. Give me the order I ordered. Uh-oh. Axie's turning into a Karen. What do I do? Hey, don't call me a Karen. I ordered a burger and you gave me fries. All right, fine, Axie. I'll give you something as reimbursement. How about a delicious free ice cream? You can have a McFlurry from us for free. Um, nom, 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 nom. I guess this is acceptable. Yay! Another happy customer at McDonald's. Now that we have our entire kitchen and ordering area all done, Axie, it's time to work on all the other amazing stuff that's going to be inside our McDonald's. Every McDonald's has a drive through so we should probably add one of those too, Axie. Oh, so that people who are really lazy or don't have time can get McDonald's everywhere. Exactly, which is actually a big percentage of customers so how about we build the ordering window right over here a nice big window so that people can drive up their cars and order whatever they want to eat today i'm gonna drive up my car right now wait hold on axie you have a car since when i have always had a car woodle it's my shopping car wait what that's not a real car but i guess you could technically use Use it to order McDonald's. So how about I start putting the lines in the road right over here? And then after that, I'm going to start putting down that big menu again because the people are going to need to order through this speaker right over here. Hello, can you hear me? Axie, you're being too loud. Yes, they can hear you in there. There's no one in there, Wudo. It's just us. Oh, yeah, I forgot. You're right, Axie. But all I need to do is just put this down, put down that graffiti again with our delicious, tasty menu, and then we can put the speakers to the left and right side so that they can talk to the person taking their order. Can I have everything on the menu? Axie, I think that would be too expensive with all your axolotl money. Sorry. What? But I helped make this place. I should get to eat all the food. Okay, fine, Axie. I guess you can have one of everything, but we need to give our customers their food first. We don't even have any customers, Woodle. Hey, stop thinking like that. We will have customers very, very soon. Axie, trust me, people are gonna be lining up all over. 
what I'm going to do now is just grab some glass over here. And just like the real McDonald's, I'll also grab some glass shutters so that I can close it just in case there's a rude customer. Like me. Give me all your food. This is a robbery. Oh, gosh. I don't want a robbery to happen. So let me grab that trap door that I was talking about. And now I can close the window. Bye-bye. What? Let me rob the McDonald's. I'm coming in through the window. Oh, no. Even worse. Okay, you know what, Axie? Nobody's actually going to rob a McDonald's. So we'll never need to worry about that. Are you sure? There are some really hungry people out there. Yes, Axie, I'm sure. And if anyone were to rob anything, it would probably be some KFC customers that are going to Mongo's KFC. McDonald's customers are way better than KFC customers. That is true, Woodo. I can confirm that. All right. Now that we have that confirmed, Axie, I'm going to put a bunch of ready-made French fries and cheeseburgers all ready to go to our our drive through customers, we need to be really fast in the drive through so that people don't drive off and get mad if we don't make their food in time. Would people really do that? Yes, Axie. People are really, really mean when they order food. So we just want to get them their meals and get them off on their day. But for the people that want to chillax and stay inside, we can build some nice, beautiful chairs and tables. So let me grab some beautiful birch chairs and some tables that they can sit at. That sounds great, Woodle. I'm going to sit here all day. Wait what? I don't know if you'd want to sit here all day, Axie. Oh, I'm definitely gonna sit here all day, Woodle. All right, fine. Well, how about we make our single seating area over here? And just to make our customers even more happy, why don't we give them some sofas to sit on? That sounds comfy, Woodle. We can actually put it all along the edge back here so that they can sit however they want. I wish I had a McDonald's like this near me all the time. Well, because we're building it in Minecraft, you technically always will, Axie. And look, I can even give it a signature McDonald's. Look, now you can chillax and eat your food right here. Where are we going to put the rest of our seating? I think we should put some big tables over here, Axie, because sometimes we might have some parties or big groups of people coming in, and we need to make sure that we can can accommodate all of them. So I'm going to build some medium sized tables over here. And then finally, I'll make some more single ones over here too. That makes sense, Woodle. This is going to be the best McDonald's ever. We just have to make sure it doesn't go too close to the ordering area, Axie. But I think we pretty much have all the seating that we need. We should be able to accommodate at least a few hundred customers. Woodle, we have like uh one two three four seven nine three thousand seats three thousand seats that should be plenty axie come on we want to make sure it isn't too crowded in here so three thousand sounds perfect to me me too Udo. i'm glad we can both count now that we have all of this done axie it's time to spice up the interior let me grab my trusty graffiti again and what we can do is put up some more of those delicious advertisements. For example, an advertisement for a Happy Meal. See? Happy Meals always make me happy. I guess that's why they're called Happy Meals. Of course that's why they're called Happy Meals, Axie. Why wouldn't a Happy Meal make you happy? Aw, it's making me happy right now. I want to eat it now. Oh gosh, I think Axie's getting a little too happy looking at it. Come on, Axie. How about we go over here and put some different type of ads. Let's go ahead and put this one. It looks really, really tasty. Wow, 
Oh, those McNuggets look delicious. So soft and tender. <laughs> oh, I think we actually ate it. Uh-oh, Axie. I hope we didn't actually, though, because it has wrappers and stuff on it. Ew. Wait, you're not supposed to eat wrappers? Of course not. Oh, gosh, Axie. You know what? You might be doomed now. I eat wrappers, like, every day. Every time I eat candy, the wrapper's like an extra bonus snack. Uh-oh, Axie. I guess axolotls are just built different. But come on. There's still one really, really important character that I want to put inside our McDonald's. And he's actually going to be responsible for taking people's orders. Ronald McDonald? Not Ronald McDonald, silly. That clown's a little bit too creepy. I want Grimace to take our orders. Grimace? You're really gonna bring Grimace here? Yup. Look, Axie. It's going to be the coolest thing ever. Grimace is actually going to take everybody's orders. Yay! He looks so silly. Hello there, Grimace. Can I please have 55 cheeseburgers, 55 fries? And oh, wait. Grimace just died. No! Your order was too long, so he left. No, don't worry, Axie. I'm going to spawn Grimace back, and there's going to be a Grimace at every single checkout area to make sure that every customer is accommodated. That makes sense, Will. We should spawn in 10 million Grimaces. 10 million Grimaces sounds like a lot. I think three Grimaces looks perfect. And then they can take all the orders. I'll even put some more advertising back over here, Axie, just to show off how amazing our McDonald's food is. Woohoo! It's looking so cool. I feel like the inside is almost done, but we need something extra special so that we can beat Mongo. You're right, Axie. How about I just put a giant life-size Grimace shake that everyone can drink from. Uh, that sounds pretty cool, but I was thinking more like we should build something outside. Oh, outside? What were you thinking of? We can add a little playground for all the kids who come and visit. And axolotls. Oh, wait. Are you talking about the McDonald's Happy Place, Axie? That is actually an amazing idea. I think we should totally do that outside. First of all, we need a way nicer entrance. Let me go ahead and put a nice little walkway here. And then I can put some beautiful hedges to the left and right so that our customers have a nice place to enter from. Where should we build the playground, Wood? I'm gonna make the slide first. Let's put the playground right over here in between the little drive through and the entrance of our McDonald's, Axie. This should be perfect. Okay, the slide is gonna go here and it's gonna be really fun. Ooh, I can't wait for a slide, Axie. You know, slides are actually one of my favorite things to play on. They are? I like them too, especially when they're like 10,000 feet high. Exactly, Axie. The drop is the coolest part of all. Anyways, let me just continue adding these hedges over here. And I guess what I can do is also add a bit of outdoor seating as well, Axie. Maybe some customers want to enjoy some fresh air. And I want to make sure that they're all satisfied and that we get plenty of good reviews. So if I make some outdoor seating, they'll get happy. No one's going to give us a bad review, Wudo. This is the best place ever. Seriously, who would give this place a bad review? I know I wouldn't, but I would, Wudo. Hey, what? Mongo, is that you finally talking? Did our pranking really make you that mad? Yeah, I'm gonna make sure to let the world know, and you're gonna get super duper bad reviews. Huh? I don't want bad reviews. Well, it's gonna happen, Wudo. This is what happens when you mess with Kentucky Fried Chicken. That's not good, Axie. We better make sure that this looks really, really good because time is running short. Oh, no. What are we gonna do? Don't worry, Axie. I know our McDonald's is looking amazing. How about we just add a nice little toy house over here so that all the kids can go inside and play in it? 
That sounds good. I want to go play now. Well, Axie, if you have nothing to play on, then you can't play on it. Come on, we're almost done. I just need to add the roof of it right over here. And now that that's all done, I can work on the mini interior too. What do kids like to play with inside of these toy houses, Axie? I'm not sure, Oodle. Maybe more french fries. Oh, yeah, you're right. What we can do is we can put a pretend stove outside where they can make fake burgers and fries. It'll be just as cool. Yeah, that sounds really fun. And then we can hire them when they're older. Wait, what? Axie, you sound so evil. It's my evil plan. <laughs> oh, gosh. All right, Axie. I guess we could do that. Let me just put some cheeseburgers and make nuggets and that looks amazing now the last thing i need to do is just put the roof on our mcdonald's we can't have it open because if we do we're gonna let in all the elements I don't want to let in the elements, Woodo. That sounds scary. No, silly. Not that type of element. I'm talking about rain and the weather, silly. Oh, I thought you meant like fire and lightning. <laughs> no, 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 silly. I'm talking about rain and dust and stuff like that. But check this out, Axie. I think it's pretty safe to say that our McDonald's is fully complete. And I'm so happy with how it came out. But unfortunately, there is one thing we still need to do, and that is go to the Kentucky Fried Chicken and shut it down once and for all. Let's go do it, Axie. Let's go. Where even is Kentucky, Woodle? Is that like in the middle of the universe? I have no idea, but I know that it doesn't look as amazing as this beautiful McDonald's. Now, come on. Let's see where Mongo is. Hello, Mongo. We're at KFC. Finally, you guys are here to see my art piece. Mongo, I have a question. Why are there signs up here that say we put poop in our food and it says go to McDonald's? Wait, what? What are you talking about? I didn't put that. Oh, uh, yes, you did. I definitely didn't do anything. Oh, yeah, Axie, you definitely didn't. Don't tell him. Wait a second. If I didn't put it, then one of you guys must have put it. Nope, one of your unhappy employees must have done it. They must have been sick of putting poop in the food. Exactly. Now let's go inside and see if there actually is poop. Wait, what? There's no poop in here, guys. This is Kentucky Fried Chicken. So all you have to do is pay $1 for some chicken and $2 for some fries. Mongo, I found poop in the cabinet. Wait, what? Are you kidding me? That is disgusting. Mongo is frying poop and turning it into KFC. Yeah. Ew. Wait a second. How'd you guys know of my secret ingredient? So it was the truth all along? I knew it! Look at these prices. They're way too high for literal poop. Everything in our McDonald's is free. So, Axie, in order to stop the contamination in this KFC, we need to grab a flint and steel and burn it to the ground. Wait, what? I'm gonna call the police. We are the police. You don't need to call any police, Mongo. You can just come to a way better restaurant, a.k.a. McDonald's. Oh, my gosh. This is not a McDonald's. This is a Poop Donald's. Okay, Mongo. It is not Poop Donald's. You had a Poop FC. This is the real deal, McDonald's. Check it out. It looks like an actual one with an entire play park, outdoor seating, and drive through if you prefer to order that way. Interesting, interesting, Budo. If I had Axie helping me build, I would have something better than this. That's true, because I am an amazing builder. Well, I don't know about that, Mongo. Maybe it was more helpful that you didn't have her. But don't say that to her. Hey, I heard that. Woo, don't take it back right now. I was just joking. It was a prank, Axie. Anyways, Mongo, why don't you come over here and take your order? Grimace is ready to serve you. No, I hate Grimace. He was all over my walls. 
And wait a second, these paintings, they were all over my walls too. Were you guys the one that put those and put the poop in the chest and then put the signs in the front? Uh, no, it wasn't totally us, right, Axie? <laughs> Definitely not. Why would we need to prove we're better than you? We obviously are. Exactly, Mongo. Check out our menu. What would you like to order? We have chicken McNuggets and burgers. Be my guest. I'll give it to you for free. I want the entire menu for free. All right, Mongo. Let me just punch that in and your total comes out to zero dollars because of how beautiful the burning KFC looks in the background. Wait, what? It's burning! Sorry, Mongo. Anyways, Axie, let me just prepare his meal. I just need to go over here and take the frozen beef patties, cook them up real quick, and now we have cooked beef that I combine with cheese and bread to get you your delicious cheeseburger and fries, Mongo. Order up! Oh, yes, Woodo. Thank you. Hong Kong! Wait, you have a customer, Woodo. Oh, hello, new customer. Customer, what would you like to order from the McDonald's drive through Can I have a milkshake with no milk and extra beef? Um, Axie, I don't know if that's an actual thing, but you can just take this raw beef patty and stuff. Is that good enough? Yummy! Oh, okay. It looks like we have two happy customers. Now that you have your meal, Mongo, where would you like to sit? You can sit inside and look at these beautiful McDonald's ads, or you could come outside and enjoy the beautiful view of a burning KFC while enjoying your delicious cheeseburger. Ah, this is the life. Hmm, I think I'll definitely enjoy sitting over here, Budo. But wait a second. I need to taste the food. I haven't tasted it yet. All right, Axie, we've been waiting for this moment. Come on, please like the food. Come on. Hold on, guys. Let me just take a quick bite, okay? Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Wait, wait a second. What's in this food? It's making my stomach hurt, and I think I'm going to fart. Uh, uh, uh. Oh, my gosh, Marco! Did you just have explosive diarrhea? Yeah. That's going to be an upset customer, Axie. We better escape before he leaves a one-star review. Let's get out of here. Oh, gosh. Your entire McDonald's is destroyed. Thank you guys so much for watching this video. If you enjoyed, then watch another video on screen. And don't forget to subscribe. Bye. Bye.